There is more flooding this morning in areas around the Passaic River, just as Craig mentioned. Yeah, CBS 2's Jesse Mitchell live for us in Little Falls, New Jersey, where they've been using pumps to try and clear out the flooded streets there. Jesse, what's it looking like right now? It's a tall order, Doug and Andrea. You can see the Passaic River behind me really steadily flowing swiftly and coming over these banks. Right now, I'm in a neighborhood on East Woodcliffe Avenue that is right in a bend of the Passaic River. So all of this water is coming up onto these houses and crossing into the street, trying to find any kind of shortcut that it can. But the problem with this, you can see it's coming down driveways and into the basements because a lot of these houses do have a sub level. And so we're seeing hoses sticking out of some of these houses and people just trying any way to protect their homes. The issue is a lot of these homes are older. They're on the river already, and so they can't easily be lifted and stormproof for future storms. So it's just a constant problem for them. They say right now, this is not as bad as it has been, but they're taking advantage of the bright skies to do a little bit of cleaning up. You see some folks down here, they have brooms out. We see some, uh, some leaf blowers out, anything to try to get their homes dry as they keep an eye on this water. And we also have all... Other crews out like Public Works, they're clearing storm grates as they try to keep any of this water flowing out of this neighborhood. And so we are going to keep an eye on it. Just because the sun is out doesn't mean the water is completely receding. It has gone down since earlier this morning when it was dark, but we're seeing it flowing fast. And so everyone still needs to be careful out there and clean up as much as you can while you can, because we have seen a couple pop-up storms coming back through here throughout the morning. Even though the sun was out, it started raining again, and then the sun came back out. So everyone just be on the lookout. Stay safe as you make your way through this area. Governor Murphy is going to be coming to Patterson this afternoon to tour some of this flooded area. He was right here earlier this week, and so it is a constant problem that we are going to continue to monitor. For now, live in Little Falls, Jesse Mitchell, CBS2 News. Gosh, Jesse, thank you. It's been such a horrific week. For it really has, and just looking at those waters behind mm -hmm. Jesse, it's it's really remarkable, and uh, we, we hope everybody there stays safe. Yeah, big cleanup ahead.